Oh man, guys, it is good to be back with the Tag Team Monday action. So glad. Whew. I can't remember the last time I started, I did this, but let's start it all over again. I'm here with my partner, Majestic. I can't remember the last name. I just Ready? only remember the first part. Fight. And I can't view the name because the rendering. I ain't trying to render it, so I can't really see that well. But anyways, we're back with the Tag Team Monday action. I'm using the Kratos, because, well, I was really pissed off at everybody. And, like, you know what? We're just going to, like, I'm just going to spam. I'm going to try to dominate everybody. Like, screw it. I mean, with me and Majestic, we're a good team. I mean, he always gets more kills than me, of course. Just like, we're, we're really good. Is that, um, with his... He, somehow he always goes to a level, gets a level 2, and I can't even get to a level, can't even get halfway to a level 2, and yeah, he's always there, he's always the first one there. He's a really good person to play with, if anybody ever plays with him. He may be annoying to play against, because he knows like every single fucking move that you do. You don't really use that many moves, but it's, he's still a good partner. And another thing I like about being a... Being a uh, teammate with him is that every time, like they try to like a uh, enemy try to do a combo, half the time we play with random people, they always just like they always leave you there so you can get hit. But him, he's like one of the like few to actually run over there and help you out to break up the combo. So that's actually a really good partner. I recommend play with him a lot. And there you go, right there, this level two. I mean. We don't always connect because like sometimes we may miss combos, but overall he's he's very good. As you can see right here, I'm just basically going for a level three because I I was really trying to outdo him. I only it only happened like two times out of twenty matches we played, but it happened. But hey, right there like I was talking about, he helps break up the combo. And right here we got the fat princess using the chicken, and I'm surprisingly I actually dodged everything. Well, thanks to help with the little, um, uh, I forgot, I really forgot his name, Toro, there we go. And now we got a level 3 Kratos going. What I like to do is, like, some, sometimes people like to jump, jump and dodge, is like the easiest thing to do. What I say is, like, when that happens, just, like, jump up and make them, make them block first, and then you go for the special. Because then that's always, that's like a, a helpful thing to do. And right here, the Toro got his level 3 going. I thought it wasn't going to happen, but because of the chip damage, it actually happened. So, that's actually good for him. So, now he got the little uh, spike thing, the orbs. I, forget, I can't even remember what the name is. It's probably on a website or something, but I'm too damn lazy to look at that. And now, time's winding down. 35 seconds left on the clock. And Prophet Rapper got at level 2. Once again. See? If you have Majestic on your team, you're basically you're basically key to win. Unless you're using a different character. Because not everybody's good with every character, I think. I know I'm not. So if you're using the Parapper, you you're most likely win, unless you're facing with some laggers or spammers. And right here I I capitalized on the kill. And then my partner got killed. But it's still good because we actually still won. And that's very good. So good job, Majestic. Good game. But hey, wait. Yep, I did more work than him. Yeah, I remember this is like one of the games. Yeah, I did better than him. Alright, moving on. Alright, right here I'm using Big Daddy along with my partner. I eat glue. Now I forget, it's like he's a Zeus, so I thought he was gonna go for a level three. Cause like mostly when people use Zeus, they will always go for level threes. And really, and if you ever face him, oh, I just lost my train of thought for a second. If you ever face him, don't normally go for blocks. Just go for a jump and dodge. Because if you go for blocks, you can break it. Ready? And here comes a big daddy action. Now I like to use him because well. It's really good. He's powerful. He's slow, but I love his um his level two and level three. Now as you see right there, that that guy was not playing, but I still attacked him because like sometimes people are not playing, but I still want to attack him because I know some bullshit like that happens. 
Like you're not even worried about the person, then he comes all he comes back all of a sudden and then he asks me about it. Now right here, I'm just really going jumping down because um I already know what's his name? Nathan Drake is gonna keep on using the barrel. And I thought I could use a rocket to blow up the barrel, but that failed. And once again, I am fat as fuck, so I can't dodge my shit. So now I'm just going to kind of go for the usual stomp. Everybody does a big daddy. I mean, you can't really you not play it. against somebody that uses you, a big daddy and not use the stomp. Here we go. And so right here, um, Nathan gets a little, gets a little um, flawed. When it actually gets to stop him. But my partner came in to help. So good job, Will. Oh, he didn't help me out. I really appreciate that because I was getting my ass whooped. And right here, I was just using this just to play around. And I thought I was going to get both of them, even because they froze, but surprisingly, I did it. And so right here, get my level 2 going. And get glued, actually being a good person, and let, be, let us face the one on one, even though I thought I was going to actually lose this. But that's the duck. And so now we're gonna go for the usual stomp, 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 stomp. But because Nathan was actually really good with blocking it, it actually counted it. Now right here, I was I was being cautious because I was gonna normally jump and die, but I know it's like they, and um, he can just use a level one to instantly kill me right there. Taking good caution, caution against this. And I missed with the little ice beam. Because I suck. Alright. And I got angry, so I started using the little two. Which I like. Which is going to be super fast. And it's no, like, some pixie dust in the air or something. And right there, that's what I was talking about. I was using the, was using the jump and dive here. He does that. But I got angry. Like, okay, I, I gotta show off. I gotta do it. Like, everybody's counting on me. And right there, I I missed. I was usually trying to go for the little lightning ball to stun him for a second, then go for a level one. Because I know that's a pretty good combo to use. It stuns him for a second, then I guess the little, um, little girl, I forgot his name. Um, man, I really did forget her name. It's, it's kind of easy, but I forgot it. Like, she comes out and then stuns the opponent, so you're able to easily kill them. But I was able to get it later on during the game. About to happen right here. Victory! Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Like me on Facebook. Game I'll be recording next. And I just love that ending music from Big Daddies. You just gotta love it. That's why I like to use it.